<laughs> All right, Hads, what are we going to do today? We're going to color a butterfly. Yes, we're going to color a butterfly. Woohoo! All right, sweetie pie, we're going to color a butterfly. Do you know what we're going to use to color the butterfly? Um, Some colored pencils? Yeah. What's special about these colored pencils? Color. Yeah, these are watercolor pencils, and that means after we color with them, we'll use some water and a paintbrush to make it look like watercolor. Is that fun? Yeah. All right, should we do it? Yeah. Okay, first thing we did, you're going to, that doesn't look like you're drawing. <laughs> Whose drawing is that? Yours. Yeah, that's mine, huh? What, what happened to your drawing? We lost it. Yeah, we lost it. We couldn't find it, and so what we did was we took a picture, or we uh, made a copy of the original drawing that I did when we did that video, huh? If you haven't seen that video yet, be sure to hop on over to that video and watch that first, and then you can come watch this one and see how we color it. Is that cool? Yeah. All right, let's do this. You ready, Hads? Mm -hmm. Should we stop talking? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, first thing, let's color the uh, flower first. So we're gonna use green, and why don't you use a light green first, and I'm gonna use this light green, and we're just gonna color in this bottom part, okay? With the light green. You could just color the whole thing in. And then we're gonna do a little shading with the dark green. Cool? Oh, you're doing a great job. And in this video, we're gonna speed up a lot of the steps. And that's so that you don't have to watch us color in everything and can kind of get to the next step quickly. And so be sure to pause it and you can catch up um, if you're doing this along with us. All right, Hads. Hey, do the little green down here on the stem. And then we're going to use a dark green next. And where's another dark green? Here we go. And what I'm going to do is color the dark green just around the edges. You see that? Make a dark edge around the bottom of the flower. Good job. That's awesome. Oh, you're even doing the top part. I should do that too. Yes. Good job. All right. You ready for the next part? Yeah. We'll put the green back over here. And... Let's do the flower, and should we do it orange? Yeah. Let's do an orange flower. And then we can do like a pink butterfly. Okay, we're gonna use orange, and after we do this, we're gonna do another color on top of it. And should we speed it up? Yeah. Okay, let's do it right now. Now. And I'm done. Awesome, Hads, good job. Okay, now we're gonna switch to red. And watch this, we're gonna do just a little light red at the very bottom close to the green. And then I, as I get up higher, I'm gonna make it go lighter and lighter until it kind of disappears. So it's just red down here at the bottom. Can you try that? Yeah. And this kind of looks like it a little bit like shading or it could just be the kind of flower that it is. It's kind of red. So make it really dark down here and then light up there. There you go. So come back down here and do really, really dark. Is this fun? Yeah. Do you like coloring? Mm -hmm. What's your favorite, coloring or drawing? Um, or both? Both. Both. <laughs> So I'm going to do red inside this one too because it's on the back. And then should we speed it up? Yeah. Alright, let's do it right, right now. now. that okay. cool? You done? Mm -hmm. Awesome. I like it, Heads. You having fun? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Alright, should we do the butterfly body? Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll do it. We'll do black. Is that cool? Because it's an insect. And then... So we just do, you can just do a light black all the way around. And I'm going to leave her little eyes white. Good. And then do her body. 
And then I, the reason why I did it light, a little lighter, is because you can come back and make her belly really, really dark. And that'll make it look like there's a shadow underneath her belly. Cool. Oh, good job, Hats. All right, let's do her wings. Okay, ready? Yeah. All right, what should we do her wings? Mm. What color should we do the big part that goes all the way around? Pink. Pink? All right, let's do it. You want that pink? And I will pick this pink. Actually, this looks like a purple, but I think it'll, let me see. It'll look pink. Yeah, it looks pink, huh? Yeah. All right, so we're gonna start really dark at the bottom and kind of do the same thing we've been doing you can get lighter as you get to the top. And I think the nice thing about watercolor pencils is that you don't have to be totally, you don't have to fill in everything because when you use the watercolor, it's gonna blend it and make it look really smooth. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, you got that wing? Mm -hmm. All right, let's do the front wings. So the wings over here and color these ones in too. And we'll speed this up because we got a lot of coloring to do, huh? Mm -hmm. All right, should we do it? Right now. <laughs> Keep going, heads. You're almost there. Almost done. You did it. That was a lot of work, huh? Yeah. <laughs> did, are, is your arm tired? Is your arm tired? Yeah. <laughs> All right, what should we do the next part? Red. We Okay, let's do it. Let's do red. All right, you got yours? I got to sharpen it. You got to sharpen it? Cool. Awesome. Good job. Ready? All right, you did it, Hads. Good job. We colored our whole butterfly, huh? And this is a, this is a, we could have stopped if we wanted to, huh? That looks pretty cool. Yeah. Do you think it looks pretty nice? Yeah. Well, let's, let's keep going. You want to do the watercolor? All right, this is the fun part. And now, this is a really fun exercise to do with a young artist. And the only thing that you kind of need to communicate to them or to explain to them is that it works best if you just stick to the colors that uh, stick to one color at a time. And so the first thing we're gonna do, I'll show you. What I mean by that is let's do the green first. Remember how we did the bottom of the flower first? Yeah. Yeah. Let's start with the watercolor too uh, down here at first. So we just add water to the green and try and keep it just inside. There you go. Good job. And it's okay if you do go outside. You got it? And do you see how it smoothed it out? So all those little pencil marks smoothed out, huh? Okay, let's rinse out the green. And that's kind of what I mean by just doing color one color at a time. If you just put water over the whole thing, it'll just blend all the colors together. All right. Okay, you got a little water? Oops, I dripped some on yours. Okay, let's do the flowers. Or the uh, petals, I mean. Okay, and you can blend them. And then try not to get your water over on the green side because then it will get green on your petals. That cool? Mm -hmm. It's looking pretty nice. <laughs> it smooths it all out really nice, huh? And we're using, we just used, we made a copy with our printer and our printer ink just, it works pretty well with water. If you work the water over the ink too much, then it does, it will start picking it up, but it does a pretty good job of staying down. You wanna do the body next? Good job. Let me smooth all of those little marks out. It's pencil marks. Good job, Ads. I like it. Okay, should we do our wings? Yeah. All right, let's do the inside red first. Or we could probably just do the whole thing. Should we just do the whole thing? Yeah. Let's just blend it. Oh, that is looking awesome. I like how it changes color, huh? It gets darker, like the pink. Do you like butterflies, hats? Yeah. 
Yeah. Have you seen a real one? Yeah. Yeah. At my school. At your school? Mm -hmm. Do they have a pet one? Yeah. Pet butterfly? Did you see it grow up? Like turn it didn't it turn into a chrysalis or something? No, it was a. Is that what it's called? It was a egg first, and it was, and it was hanging up in a day, and then it was getting green and green, and then <laughs> and its body was getting full green, mm -hmm. and then it turned into a butterfly. And then it turned into a butterfly. Did you guys let it go? No. You kept it mm -hmm. in its little cage. <laughs> Hans, look at that! That's awesome! Do you want to keep going? Was there another part you wanted to do? I think you got it all. Was that fun? Yeah. We hope you guys had fun painting your, your butterflies with us. And we'll see you later, our friends. <laughs>